like flinching or not, man? You good? Fuck it. Go for it. I don't know what I'm saying. You don't know what you're saying? What's going on? Um, you're the interview person. I am the interview person. <laughs> Just want to hear your name and how long you've been a Blackhawk. My name is uh, Blaze Friedel. Um, my cold name, I go by it quite a bit. Blaze being, you know, the regular uh, Mr. Snail Trail himself. Uh, Mr. Pink Saga Dawkins, 1985, asked about me. I mean, go, this goes on and on, but we could be here all day with that. But And I've been a black wolf for about almost six years now. Oh, oh hold on, hold on. We need to be together. We, we interview on. as a team. It's true. It's on board. What's going on? Not much. What's your name? How long have you been a Blackhawk? Spiz. What's your Blackhawk. actual name? <laughs> that is my actual name. Yeah. Uh, Spencer Goldman, aka Spiz. Been a Blackhawk for about what a happened? year. I think the cops are coming for us. Uh... Yola. It's the yeah. fire brigade. Yeah. yeah so really? There's a fire. Where? <laughs> Apparently, there's a fire. Going through a hot smoker grenade. Into a bale of hay up on Crossfire. Oh, sweet. Yeah, yeah, pretty dope. Yeah, so people here are idiots. Oh. <laughs> are you recording? Oh. Yeah, of course. Are oh, you recording? Yeah. yeah, people here are dumb. We're here at beautiful Battle Creek. Um, <laughs> this is the best interview ever. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Most we, we couldn't have planned this better. No, it's yeah. a true story. This is all going up on YouTube. Oh, I don't care. Great. This is the raw footage that this has to go footage. up. We're raw and uncut. That's what we get with the black hole. <laughs> nothing else. I mean, I'm cut too. Yeah. <laughs> but it's all right. So, uh, what separates the Blackhawks from everybody else? I got big dicks. I mean, nah. The black hole from everybody else, we're more like a family atmosphere than just a bunch of people. You know, I mean, I hang out with, you know, everybody here all the time. I mean, we eat fucking Taco Bell. He smacks a burrito on his face. True I mean, story. It's, it's more like a family atmosphere more than, I guess, a, uh, a team. I mean, I hate some of the people. Like, you know, like, like some people. I hate some people in the family. It's all right, though. You're supposed to. You're supposed yeah. to. We come here to have a good time. Hate's a very strong We play word. together. We laugh. We, we I mean, fun. yeah, we do everything. When we, we have to get serious, we do. We're good players, so. But we still know how to have fun. That's what it's all about. Yep. What's your favorite story from being a Blackhawk? You can take the first one first, because you've only been here for a little while. I'll favorite think about story that. from being a Blackhawk? I don't know. I think it was just us chilling at the hotel room before a big game. <laughs> Getting drunk. Before I crashed my car? Yeah, before you crashed your car. Wow. Yeah, yeah I remember that. He thought he was going off-roading. He went down the ditch. <laughs> <laughs> the twitch ditch. The twitch ditch. Um, what would I, what would I be saying, my I mean, It's been six years. Um, pro I would, truthfully, probably the hotel thing. The hotel from last year was probably the most fun. It was, we were even playing paintball. That's what I'm saying. Like, most of the time when I'm coming up to paintball, I just want to go to Fuddruckers anyway. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, when we were at that hotel, first off, me and Spencer right here, or Spiz as he likes to be called, you know, artist formerly known as Spiz, he, uh, we were going down and we were saying we were definitely going to get, you know, we were trying to see what type of hotel we were going to have. We were going to have, if it was going to be a real shitty crackhead hotel or if it was going to be, you know, amazing. It ended up being a crackhead hotel, and as soon as we got in, we were talking about we're definitely going to get laid there for very, very little dollars. $5 BJs. Yeah, $5 BJs are fucking where it's at. Um, but no, it was fun, and we made it fun. Uh, I mean, drinking, we drinking all had 40s. 40s. Yeah. yeah, and uh, yeah, it was pretty good. By all means, yeah, yeah, please right. use. Just go ahead and go. <laughs> use it. Don't worry about it, so. It's our office. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think other people think of the Blackhawks? Uh, personally, I think they're... Most people probably think we're assholes and we're dicks just because we shoot them all the time. <laughs> like, I'm not even trying to be like... I mean, when we play up here in our home field and everything, we get people that are like just... You know, you get all different types of skill level here. And we'll, we want more people to come here that are higher skill level because it only makes us better. But I think a lot of people, you know, when they when you get beat, obviously, I know when I do, when I get beat, I try to make excuses about it. So I know they probably don't see us in the greatest light, but we're hoping to change that. Yeah, we're, we're, we're a community German. Yeah, we're not trying to ruin the day for anyone. If we see, like, rookies out there, we take it easy, we help them out. I mean, there's sometimes people just pop out and and a few people might shoot them at the same time and they think we're lighting them up, but really, we're, they're not trying to ruin anyone's day. True story. Where would you like to see the Hawks in a year? I don't think that guy washed his hands. <laughs> I don't think he washed his hands either. 
Don't, <laughs> don't shake his hand. Don't, definitely don't shake his hand. <laughs> <laughs> where do we see the Blackhawks in a year? Yeah. I'm hoping to just keep continuously grow. I mean, from where the Blackhawks started six years ago, it was a bunch of people from Patterson that started the actual Blackhawks. And then a couple of people, which included myself, uh, Antonio Hand. Shout out to Hands. I haven't seen him in years. I thought you were my best friend, son. Um, a couple of Oscar, who you saw yep. right here, his brother. We all came together. And all those people from Patterson are pretty much gone at this point. And the only ones that are left are the two founders, uh, Lee and Angel. So I just hope that, and yeah, that, that just happened. Like I said, raw and uncut, that's the way we do it here at Battle Creek. And um, I hope to add more members. I would personally like to add more members. I'd like to have, you know, maybe some speedball get thrown in there. Maybe not competition, but just, you know, have fun. Start out, see what happens with it. I just hope, you know, just to keep growing. That's pretty much where I'm at at this point. Yeah, it gets more people. For when we go to uh, big events or something, we can show up with more than five or six people. Um, it looks pretty pathetic when other teams are showing up with 30. But we mainly want people who are out there to have fun, play well, not take it too seriously unless need be. But yeah, hopefully the team will grow, get some more people out here each Saturday or Sunday. People serious yeah. business, bro. Yeah, I mean, we got koozies to match our jerseys. <laughs> and, like, that's serious paintball right there. Luxury sport. Yeah. Remember, paintball, if I could tell one person, if, not just one person, if I could tell the whole paintball community, remember, paintball is 95% what you look like on the field. Yeah. And only 5% of the skill. If accessorize. you don't accessorize, if you don't accessorize or anything like that, it's, it's crazy. Yeah. You know, 95% is just the way you look. You intimidate the shit out of people, they're like, if you're looking for quality stuff, eye to eye. They, Shout out to Al, eye yeah, to eye. They, they make all their stuff great quality, holds up well. From the day you confirm the order to you getting it, it's like two weeks, really fast. Unlike other companies that we're waiting a year on, but HK Army. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not blowing you up, but yo, your company's not good. Yeah, it's been a year. It's haven't been got my a year. Jersey yeah. yet. Anything else you guys want to say? I love Blaze. I mean, I love him too, but I, I just wanna, I just wanna see the the Blackhawks continue to grow. I mean, this is our baby. It's, it's everybody's team. It's not just you know the people who started this team. It's everybody's team. I just want to continue to grow, and I, I want it more sexy time on the field. I think there should be a minimum amount of humping that should happen, and if it doesn't be reached, you get punched in the you know dick. I mean, I don't know what else to say? I mean. I love you, but yeah, you gotta be half gay on this team. That's so anyway, you have to be. Yeah, you have to. Have, <laughs> you have to be able to take a joke on this team. Yeah, and I think that's a lot of reason why people don't like us either. We joke around a lot. I mean, at some point throughout the day, someone will be humping you, and you just have to accept that. And if you don't take it, don't, don't even apply. <laughs> you took shit. Thanks, guys. Yeah, not a problem. Thank you.